Is there a nicer sight than a lovely flat bone like that? Flat bone. Check me on. What am I on about? Hello and welcome to Wing It episode two with me, Joe McGraw. Folk you, hey? No, 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 folk you. No, 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 folk you. No, 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 folk you. No, 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 folk you is where we're going today. It's a classic gag. Folk you is a place in Chinatown in Manchester, a Vietnamese place which is unbelievable with the freshest ingredients, the freshest folk, proper Vietnamese family behind the whole thing, and their wings are something else. I was sat there minding my own business. I picked a random day, quite quiet. Little did I know I'd see some friends coming down. Oh God, they're gonna see me reviewing wings. Yeah, you're right, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then a work colleague came down as well with his mate. And it, have we all ended up here? So maybe I'm trying to whisper it because I don't want to give away how good I am at reviewing wings in this. Well, let's go to Faux Q. No, 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 Faux Q. No, 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 no Faux Q. And see how they did. in Chinatown in Manchester. My first visit to Chinatown on Wing It. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I probably said all that at the beginning, haven't I? I've got myself a Vietnamese coffee recommended by the guys here to really perk me up. And it's banging. Nice and sweet, delicious. Uh, Bump set the table, as you can see. Trying today the salt and pepper wings and the honey wings as well. We're looking for appearance, taste, Value for money. So we have the sweet and spicy, our homemade recipe chicken wings, and then we have the salt and pepper. Even though the salt and pepper, but we manage the seasoning a little bit differently. Yeah. So hopefully, it tastes a bit Thank you very much. I've just been handed two of the finest dishes. The salt and pepper wings. There, you got a bit of that, a little bit of that, and the honey family recipe wings. Take a load of that. The appearance is stunning, the garnishes. I think it's the crispy onions with the spring onion as well on top there is what I'm going to go in for first. Oh my, I know it's messy, but I've got to say, the sweetness of those wings, with a little bit of kick in there. It is stunning, blow my head off. I'm gonna go back in on them. Look at that, the flat wings just catching the crispy onions with the spring onion. Oh my. Never underestimate how nice honey and wings go together. Now, if you've never had a honey wing before, if you see it on the menu, oh, dive in. Now, it's time to try the salt and pepper wings. Also on the menu here at Folk Q. Look at that. Spoke to the guy. You know salt and pepper's done everywhere, but they wanted to do their take on it. Fresh ingredients, fresh way of glazing the salt and pepper wing, so it just got that flavour to it. The flavour we all know and love. But taken up a level. Yeah, yeah, that's a next level salt and pepper wing. I am flying through these. Is there a nicer sight than a lovely flat bone like that? Flat bone. Get me on. What am I on about? A couple of things I know why the wings are good. One is when you finish with them, you go back for a bit more just in case you've missed anything off. Do you know what I mean? Are you with me on that? Two, you finish them speed, they fly through them. Four, I've not even said three yet, and three, you want more. I shouldn't order more, I might have to, because they've been absolutely stunning. Last wing of the box. We've had the honey wings, we've had the salt and pepper wings. For me, out of the two, the honey wing wins it. Family recipe. And you can just see how good it looks. It's going in my mouth. And they are, devoured. Now it's time to crack on 
with the review. The appearance, lovely. When it came out, you got very hungry very quick when you saw them. The honey ones with the sauce on it and the spring onions looked to die for you, went to dive straight in. So, I'm gonna give the appearance a solid eight out of 10. I'm gonna rate the taste two different ways. I'm gonna rate the honey ones, I'm gonna rate the salt and pepper ones. The honey ones, for me, some of the best wings I've had. I'm gonna give them 9.5 out of 10. Oh, nice, isn't it? Salt and pepper ones, lovely, stunning, solid, 8.5 out of 10. The value for money, you come in here, you have them before you fell, a couple of quid, you get six of the best wings you'll get. Value for money, 8 out of 10. Absolutely stunning. So overall, I'm leaving here incredibly satisfied with an overall score for OQ, because I can't do me adding up of, Hopefully a graphic came up there. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, check them out. I'm dead sweaty because I've had a, I think I've had a chilli from somewhere. <sighs> I'm going to go have some water. Actually, I've got a delicious Vietnamese coffee here, by the way. Have you ever had Vietnamese coffee? Well, as I wash all this down, Thank you. Holding their own in the wings game in Manchester. Over and out. Enjoy your wings. Thank you very much. That is episode two. Back next week. For more, bye.